Hi guys. How is everybody? Angie brushes boards and stenciled up. How you doing? We're gonna paint. Guys, tomorrow night. Tomorrow night, I'm doing something different. I'm doing a different painting thing. So come hang out with me tomorrow night. But it won't be it won't be seven, it'll be six o'clock tomorrow night for that um, marathon. Say hi when you come on. You guys liking these marathons or what? Hi, Scott. How are ya? Hi, Alicia. Hi, Perry. If anybody's new, say hi. Hi, Aileen. How's everybody doing? Hi, Mary. We're gonna paint this half daisy. Hi, Angie. I'm gonna wait for a few people to hop on and then I'm gonna start it. No bow tonight. Hi, Joyce. Hey, Ellen Wellen. We're gonna paint this half daisy. See that? It's gonna be so cute. Hi, Carly. I know, isn't that parrot cute? I just did him. Hi, Kathy. Thanks, Ellen, for pinning that. Hi, Debbie. We're going to paint this half daisy. This is going to be a quick one because it's kind of, it doesn't take much to paint that. So, hi, Stacy and Alicia. Hi, friends. So, let's get started. So, after me tonight is Design with Scott. And after Scott is... Amber, Crazy Craft Mamas. You guys go check them out, too. We're doing a mar marathon for 60 days. Hi, Dana and Debbie and Julie Coy. So, I'm going to start. Let me see if I can get this whole flower up in here. All right, there we go. That'll work, right? Hi, Joyce. So, I'm going to start with... Glad to see you, Betty. Hi, Pat. I'm going to start with... This is peony, my peony pink, but it's got white in it, so it's... Peony pink plus white mixed together because I wanted it a little lighter. Hi, Kathy and Susan. So first, I'm going to go around my edges first. Scott is on after me, Jenny. So right after me, Scott will jump on. Hi, Janet. And then Crazy Girl After Mama after Scott. And tomorrow night, it'll switch up a little bit. Hi, Peggy. So I'm going to go around my outside first. Hi, Sharon. Make sure you swipe the top. As you're going, because you don't want to leave paint, a bunch of paint up there. Happy Wednesday, Kate. Thank you for sprinkling, Pat. Guys, don't forget to sprinkle if you would. We're all still trying to grow. <laughs> Lisa, me too. Hi, Kathy. Me too. I got to write everything down, or else it's not going to happen. Hi, Betsy. If I don't write it down or tell Ellen, it's not going to happen. Yes, yeah, Scott's after me. And then Amber. Tomorrow night it'll change a little bit. Hi, Judy. Because me and Jan are in that marathon tomorrow. Oh, yay, Tina. Hi, Pamela. This one's going to be pretty quick, though, because this one's kind of kind of smaller. Hi, Laura. So I'm going all the way around my outside. You guys want my numbers for tonight? So, hi, Donna and Janice. The painted flower is $6.96. The blank door hanger is $6.95. Hi, Jan Mays. I miss you. And the um, wreath blank is $6.97. Hi, Sharon. And if you guys, guys, I got my YouTube going today. So if you wouldn't mind, go follow me on YouTube so I can get up to 1,000. 1,000, um, not watchers. What are they called on YouTube? Not followers. They're called subscribers. Subscribers. Hi, Nelly and Shirley. So, I won't be going live on there. I'll just put be putting videos on there. Me, uh, medium density, density fiber board is what MDF is. If I'm frozen, go back out and come back in. Because I'm not frozen on my end. Yeah, at least I started doing that too. I have to. Hi, Brad. Brad, lo Kurt loved your liver and onions. Loved it. Hi, Jackie. So, if you wouldn't mind, go subscribe to my YouTube channel. Isn't that crazy? Hi, Abby. 
I'll see you in a couple weeks. So I'm painting the whole top this mixed color that I did, guys. Peggy, I can't wait. When I get off here, I'm going to go listen to Scott and watch Survivor at the same time. Because I can't miss Survivor. Kurt will throw a fit. Hi, Janetta. So I'm doing this whole top the same color. And we're going to do a couple coats. Awesome, JC. Not frozen. Yeah, guys, if it ever freezes or you lose sound or something, go out and come back in. Hi, Dakota and Denise. Okay. Oh, yeah, Shirley, I hope you're feeling better. Ooh, Carol, no. I had to leave. I couldn't stay in the kitchen while he ate it. Oh, are you now? No, I'm not, Scott. I'm not. I would never watch Survivor while you're on. No. Heck no. I forgot you're watching. <laughs> Hi, Marie. I know, Abby. I can't wait to. I need a little mini vacation. Hi, Barbara and Tracy. Okay, so I got my whole top done. This tip top right here, you don't need it. It's going to be a different color. Oh, she coughed in your face. Crazy train, you hear it? It's cold here, Ruth. It's ugh, it's horrible today. Nothing like the other day. Hi, Lisa Hartnagel. I know I love this pink. I mixed it up myself. It's just a mixture of, mixture of peony and white. So let, ooh, let me turn this heat off. It's getting hot in here. Thanks for sprinkling, Cindy. Guys, if you wouldn't mind sprinkling us out. Hi, Joy. Haunted, the haunted train. The numbers are painted is 696, door is 695, and wreath is 697. Ugh, no. Hi, Deborah. Thanks for the star, Cindy. Liver and onions, uh, no. No way. Hi, Angela. No, I can't even smell it. Can't even smell it. Thanks for the star, the Amber. It makes me sick in this moment. So gross, I can't look at it, nothing. Hi, Charlene. Okay, let's get this really dry and we're gonna get us another good coat on it. Serena, mine either. No, Brad cooked it and Ellen got home and it, her hot, whole house stunk. It kind of looks like mauve. I love this color. I probably won't ever be able to mix it like this again, but I love this color. Hi, Sharon. Hi, Marcia. So we're gonna get really dry and do another coat. How's everybody's Tuesday today? Right, tell him. Cindy, I see that. Hi, Patricia. Okay, let's get us another good coat on here. Hi, Kim Griffin. Sprinkle, you hit the little... <clears throat> Mine just changed, so I'm not sure. There was a little arrow down there that you hit. Thanks for the stars, Jackie. Oh, Peggy, no, I can't. I can't even watch Kurt make it or eat it. Look. That's like watching somebody eat a rare steak bleeding all over the plate. Look. No, see you in no way. That's just, it's wrong. It's wrong. Hi, Nancy. It's so wrong on so many levels. Hi, Jane and Cheryl. So I'm getting me a good coat of this. We'll call it rose again. It was steak, huh? That's funny. I never ate it. My mom never cooked it, though. It's Wednesday. I knew that, Beth. It's Wednesday. When I don't work, I don't know the days. Thanks for sprinkling, Wanda. So we're doing another good coat of this mixed concoction, which I call it Rose. Hi, Sarah. Thanks for the stars, girlfriend. It's Wednesday. Only reason I know is because it's trash day. Yeah, Barf is right. Thanks for the stars, Scott Waterman. You being so nice today, what's wrong with you? What's wrong with you? Ugh. Ugh. No, I can't even talk about it. It makes me want to vomit. Hi, Lorraine. So we're almost done with this part, guys. This one's going to be really quick. This one is super easy. Super easy. This could be a beginner one. Hi, Jane. All right. So that's done. Let's dry it. 
it's dried up. We can get rid of, oh, I might want to keep that. Serena Pink's my favorite color. Pink and I like black. Yeah. You had trouble with my video? Oh no, Laura. Thanks, Sue. Hi, Nancy. Okay. Some, something's going on outside. I can hear something. I agree, Ruth. Look. Hi, Paula Dean Doan. Yeah, there's my uh, YouTube. If you guys wouldn't mind uh, following it. Not following it, but... Scott wants something. What's he want? Hi, Nancy. Me too, Serena. I can't stand it. Oh, he wants something because he's being nice. Right. She only knows Sunday. Ellen did such a great job on her live, didn't she, guys? She needs to go live more often. She's going to go live this weekend, guys. A couple times, I think. Thank you, Phyllis. So watch for Ellen in, in our... Um... Oh, somebody just subscribed. Thank you, Karen Knowles. Hi, BJ. She's going to go live in our marathon this weekend. Oh, yay. You liked your surprise. Guys, there's one more box left on my website. Somebody better grab it. I can't believe there's one more box left. Thank you, May. There's one more uh, mystery box left. So somebody better grab it before it's gone. Because I don't put them out that often. Ellen did awesome. Her wreath turned out gorgeous. Oh, good, Lord. There's my, yeah, it's at Stencil It Up is what you got to search on my uh, YouTube. Oh, Pickle Pig Feet. Oh, heck no. No, that just, no. Mm -mm. Um, Crazy Crafting Mama with K's, Nancy, is where I get all my shirts. She'll be on after Scott tonight, pressing stuff. I did too, Margie. She did a great job. All right, that's dry. So what we're going to do next Hi, Janet. What we're going to next is we're going to use a stencil. See this right here? This is the stencil. And it just goes right here on the tip top of the board. Of the board. So right there. And all we're going to do is we're going to tape it down. Bye, Rita. Couldn't get on the YouTube? Oh, no, Rita. I wonder why. Hi, Brenda. So I'm going to tape that down just like that. Well, don't move on me. And we're going to use a mixture of lighter gray and darker gray. So it is Dixie, but, or Driftwood and Hurricane Gray. JoJo just went live. She was already live today. I was watching her. Oysters? No, can't do that either. Ellen's uh, page is Ellen Wellen Designs. Ellen Wellen Designs. All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to start off with our light gray, and then we're going to kind of blend into our darker gray. Hi, Beverly. And I'm going to use, let me find me a good stencil brush. Where's my good ones that we're getting right have on the website? It, it's under at stencil it up is my, um, is my uh, YouTube. At stencil it up. Where is my, I just had my good stencil brush. Now I can't find it, guys. Pickles, pig feet, oh. Thank you, Becky. I just painted that um, parrot today. Turned out really cute. Nasty food. I can't find my stencil brush. It's making me upset. Found it. Got it. You like liver and onions? Oh, no. I eat crab legs. Oh, I love me some crab legs. But no shrimp or nothing like that. Ugh, no. You grew up with brains, eggs... Brains and eggs for breakfast? Oh, Nancy, no. Uh-uh. No, I can't. I can't do that. I never... I would I would have starved. I would have starved. I can't eat deer. I can't eat squirrel. Nothing like that. Hi, Sherry. I spray... I can grab it, Eleanor. I'll grab it. It's called uh, Krylon 2 times. Alicia will type it in here in a second. Hi, Paris. But if she don't, I'll grab it and show you. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start at the top with my light gray. Angle brushes, no. I'd like to get some angle brushes on my website. There it is right there. 
but I don't I don't know if we will or not. Hi, John. Thank you. So I'm going to start with the lighter gray on the top. You know what? I'm going to go ahead and do the whole thing lighter gray, and then we'll dry it and do another coat, and then we'll kind of mix in the darker. It's at stencil it up. No spaces or anything. At stencil it up is what my YouTube is. Oh, no. Kurt used to eat squirrel and all that. I can't. There it is right there. So if you hit that and go and go subscribe and come right back, if you can't find it, you can do it that way. Me neither. No, none of that wild game stuff. No, 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 no. No bloody steak, nothing like that. My stuff's got to be burnt. Burn it to a crisp. <clears throat> she just did. Uh, Alicia, will you, will you uh, pin my YouTube at the bottom? Oh, so it's in my link tree. So if you click on the link tree and get on the link tree, it's there. And you just hit a button and you'll be at the YouTube. Hi, Patricia. So let me dry this. We're going to do another coat. Yeah, it's on the link tree. So if you hit the link tree at the bottom, it'll take you there. Oh, uh, me too, Serena. That's exactly like me. No. I, Amber, no. I can't believe you eat medium, Amber. You're so picky. I can't believe it. Turkey, I've never had a turkey burger. Me too, Harleen. Well done. Make it charred on the edges. It'd be even better. All right. So now, we're going to start again at the top with our light gray. And when we get a little bit down, we're going to start going into the dark gray. So I'm going to get the light gray coat on here. And then I'm going to dip into my hurricane gray. So I ate deer one time. That's only because Kurt made chili. And he lied to me and told, it was ham told me it was hamburger. And then I didn't eat any more after that. Ugh. It was gross. Squirrel pot pie? Ugh. No, can't do that. That sounds nasty, too. So I'm just, I'm just tapping in a little dark gray. And we're just kind of, kind of blended in a little bit. Just so it's like ombre in there. Link tree is right at the bottom. It says Ellen Wellen Link Tree, right pinned at the bottom. Thank you. It's Brandy, sometimes they have to send out, it has to send out so many texts or messages that sometimes it's slow. Smoke goose, no. No. Not, no, not me. So, see how it's kind of ombre? That's how I wanted it. Venison, never had it. See that? That's how I wanted it. So I'm going to take, well, I'm not going to take my stencil off. What I'm going to do next is I'm going to take a pencil. And I'm just going to draw down these lines so we know where they're supposed to be, okay? Thank you, Tony. If I can find my pencil. Guys, I'm a hot mess. Okay, here it is. So I'm just going to draw, just put a pencil line down these little strips right here. Just so we know where the petals separate. Oh, can't do rabbit either. No. Nope, nope, nope. That's right. I thought I was doing it wrong. I'm not. My colors went white. Why does it do that? So, there. I don't know why it does that. Is that better? I need Kurt to look at this lighting. Something's messed up with it. Can you see it now? I moved it. You should be able to see it now. Everybody see it now? Oh, no. No rabbit or lamb. No. Okay. So, let me show you what I got. Hi, Ann. Yay, Sierra. Better. Okay. So see this? Here's my gray. And see my pencil marks? That's all I did. So what I'm going to do next is I'm going to go in with a paintbrush. Thank you, Sierra. And it's going to be a little bitty paintbrush. Let me see which one I want to use. I'm going to use a little bitty angle brush right there, okay? What I'm going to do is I'm going to use the dark gray, the hurricane gray, the smallest ones are four ounces. Oh, no, Shirley. If I knew it was deer, I wouldn't even eat it. I couldn't. I wouldn't be able to eat it. Kurt lied to me, and I ate it, and I, I was mad. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I got a little gray on my brush. All I'm going to do is I'm going to start with the, the lines that go all the way through the petal, okay? And I'll show you. This is all I'm doing, taking it all the way through the petal, okay? Some of them don't go all the way through. You can totally tell which one does. It's pretty much, it's every other one. Thank you, Shirley. It's every other one that goes through the petals. 
So I'm going to do the every other one first. Yay, last box sold. Yay. So every other one is what I'm going to do first. And I'm just dragging this little paintbrush down it. Thank you, Margie. So just dragging it down. That's all. This is really easy. Hi, Patty. Tacos with turkey. I'm going to have to try turkey burger. I do. I need that shirt. I need a lot of shirts. Amber keeps me pretty stocked up with shirts. Okay. So I went down the ones that, that go down the petals. See that? That's what you want to do first. Thanks, Jana Mays, for the stars. Okay, so now I'm going to go down the other ones and only to where the pencil stops, okay? Only to where the pencil stops. So just like that. Thanks for the stars, guys. You guys are awesome. Turkey and chicken ground up. I've never had turkey. I mean, I've had turkey, but not that kind of turkey. Okay, so that's what we got. Now, I'm going to go around the outside with this paintbrush as well. So, I'm going to do kind of light and dark. So, I'm going to mix a little dark gray with the light gray for the outside. I don't know why. I just felt like it. So, you got to kind of go slow when you're doing this, though. It tastes like hamburger? Oh, I could try it then. So, what I do, guys, it's easier if you put... See how I got my pinky right here? I mean, on the edge of the board. It's kind of easier if you keep your pinky on there and just glide it. It, it helps you stay on in line. So I keep my pinky on the side. Homemade chicken fajita meat. Mmm, I love that. Love that. So see how I'm keeping my pinky on there? It just helps you glide and stay on the edge. Thanks, Ellen Wellen. So that's all I'm doing is keeping my pinky on the edge of the board. And we're gonna go all the way around these petals. Now when you get to the curvy part of the petals, you can't keep your pinky on there. Hi, Cheryl. Thank you, Jill. So when you get to the, the curvy part, you can't keep your pinky on there, just go slow. If you mess up, paint over it, try again. Paint, painting, you can always fix it. Always fix it. So I'm just kind of doing a highlight all over the all over the flower. And then we're gonna put welcome in the middle with the stencil. Hi Amanda. How is everybody tonight? Are you guys liking this marathon or what? Who all is liking these marathons? Give me some hearts if you like these marathons we're doing. I think it's kind of fun. Gives you guys something to do every night, huh? Thank you, Marta. I love pink and gray together, guys. Pink and gray are amazing together. Tur I've ne Turkey burger just don't sound good to me. You love them both, Connie. Thank you. You could add a B on this. Jan is going to make me some ladybugs, and I'm going to add them on the flowers for my door hangers. They're going to be so cute. Thank you, Sarah. You guys are gonna have, be busy watching all these lives for the next 60 days. Thank you, Dawn. Awesome. No, I don't have a, I have a bee button, but if I had one of Jana's bees, I'd put it on this flower, but I don't wanna put a button on it. All right, so let me show you what I got. Thank you, Garleen. Purple and gray would be really pretty on this too. Violet, light violet and gray would, would be adorable. Okay, so this is what we got so far. See that? We're gonna dry it and then we're gonna put our welcome down the middle and we're gonna put some black dots up here. 31 years ago. You like watching them? Thank you, Sierra. Okay, so I'm gonna dry it really good because we're gonna do our welcome stencil next. You guys are loving the marathons. Oh, eight weeks, trees, so that's a long time. I have a butterfly coming. I do. I got a couple of butterflies coming. Awesome, Billy. Mine is 30 days. Theirs is 60, 60 days. I'm only doing 30 days. 
Ugh. I don't think I'd like a turkey burger. It just does not sound good to me. Happy hump day, Gail. Who is that? Donna, where you been? Hi, Rhonda. Life's better than ever. Oh, my gosh. 13 hours. That's crazy. Awesome. Sierra. Hi, Barbara. All right. Here's our welcome to Simpsons. It's kind of slanted, but I wanted it slanted like this. So what you're going to do is you're going to put it, you can kind of put it wherever you want. Glitter in the middle. Hi, Teresa. Thank you, Janetta. So I eyeball it, guys. I don't measure nothing. I just eyeball it. So I'm going to eyeball it in the middle of the flower. And I'm going to tape it down because you got to tape them, tape them down. Hi, Marty. Uh, Connie, I'll do the camper one on the live if you want me to. Yep. So I'm going to tape it down because I don't want my paper to move because that would make me mad. And we're going to do these letters black. We're going to do these letters black. Oh, darn. You, don't, you know what I didn't do, though? Hi, Zila. You know what I didn't do? I got to do this. Hold on. Let's back up a tiny bit. Back up. Beep, beep. Back up. Hi, Renee. Thanks for sprinkling. Hi, Hazel. So, on these edges, I, I wanted to swirl a little white in there. I'm going to do it. So, I'll have to go over a little bit of this gray. But we're not in a hurry because this one's quick. So let me do that. Because I want I want a little white swirled in. So I'm just going to go. So what you would have did is went right after your pink, your second coat, when your pink is still wet. You guys see me do this all the time. You're going to just swish a little white in there. So I'm going to do that right now because I wanted it and I forgot. So we're going to do that right now. And I'll just go around my edges again. It's not, not a big deal. I am. I'm doing the Highland Cow tomorrow night with the sunflowers on that marathon. It's going to be super cute. That's what I'm doing. So I'm putting a good coat. Hi, Juanita. Because I want my white to swish in there. So I'm going to take my paintbrush and dip it in the white just to get the ends a little with a little white on them. And I just swirl the white in with this wet pink, okay? Just like that. And it gives it a little highlight effect. I like that. So that's what I'm doing. See how it just highlights it a little bit? I forgot to do that. This, this one's your one of your favorites, Angela. I love this one. I thought, oh, that's going to be too simple. But once I did it, I loved it. A fairy would be gorgeous with it. It would. It totally would. So that's what I wanted to do, and I forgot. So we got it done. Let me, let me dry it and just put my gray around there real quick. Only take a second. But I wanted that white swirl in there. Kurt's not supposed to have red meat either, but he eats it. We don't eat as much as we used to, but he still eats it. Thank you, Mary. So we want to get it dry, because I got to go around it again with my gray, because I forgot that. So guys, remember the numbers on this one is painted is 696. Door blank is 695. Wreath blank is 697. Thanks for the stars, Teresa. I appreciate it. More than you know. Hold on. I'm out of the screen. Okay, let's put our gray back in here real quick, and then we'll be back to where we were. I apologize. I forgot all about that. And it makes it look so much better, so I had to do it. So, here I go. Back again on the outside of my, outside of my flower. Putting it back on. Just like that. right around the outside just like I did before but I forgot to switch my white in no Stacy I, today I made a stencil somebody wanted a stencil a tall welcome sign with the camper as the O so I did that today and put it on the website and she was wanting to know if I would do one on a live and I can because I got 30 days to do things so yeah I can but it's on the website now and then somebody wanted to welcome with the Highland Cow in the middle of the O. And I'm going to do that too. I have not forgot about you. So I'll probably work on that tomorrow. But I have not forgot. Okay, we're almost done with this part again. Yeah, this one's real simple and just cute. At first I thought, mm, that might be a little boring. And then I painted it and I'm like, oh no, I love that. So... Yeah, take a look. 
I'll paint it on live. I don't know when. Sometime in this 30 days, I'll do it. We're going to have to find a lot of things to do in 30 days, so I might be scrambling at the end. But I'm going to do some DIYs and stuff, so that'll be good, too. Hi, Fern. Okay, we're almost done with this part. I don't even have a watch out here. Oh, God, I got a half hour. I got plenty of time. Daisies, daisies and sunflowers are my favorite flowers, guys. I love white sunflowers. Okay, Cindy. I love white sunflowers. They're my favorite flower. All right, we're back at it. So now, we're gonna take, that's really dry, so we're gonna take, hi, Tammy. No, you don't get anything. You just, you're just doing it to say you did it. Thank you, Roxanne. Okay, so I'm gonna take my black paint pen and I'm just gonna, no, I'm not gonna do my paint pen. I'm gonna use the end of a paintbrush. I'm gonna use the end of a paintbrush. Just the end of this paintbrush right here. That's all I'm gonna do with black. So I'm gonna pour some black on my paper and I'm just gonna dot it on this flower up here. Daisy and then tulips. I like tulips too. So all I'm doing is dipping the very end of this brush down in my paint and putting dots on my board. Really easy. A bear. I could do, probably do a bear. A grizzly bear. I could look for one. So I'm just putting dots, little black dots, random. Don't matter where you put it. Don't matter how many you put. Thank you, Cindy. Whatever you like. However many you want. I'm not going to load it. I just want some, a few. Well, I don't like that little dot. So if you don't like your dot, just go back right back over the top of it. And I think that's all I'm going to do. I just wanted a few. That's all I want. So now we're going to do our welcome. And then we'll be done. So back to our welcome stencil. Here it is right here. No inserts on this one. I made this one easy so nobody had any inserts. You just eyeball it on there and tape it down. <clears throat> and now, guys, this is the most important part when you're stenciling. Let me close some of these up. Thank you, Anne-Marie. Um, call the loft. Call the loft tomorrow. They'll help you. Yep, call the loft tomorrow. When they're open, they'll help you. All right, let me get my stencil brush. Okay, here we go. Um, 10 minutes, Scott. All right. So uh, my letters are going to be black. And guys, when you do these letters, I know there's a lot of new people out here. So let me show you real quick. I hope I didn't. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. I'll fix those. Look what I did. I put it in my dots. Big dummy. I put it right in my dots. That's right. I'll fix them. It's super simple fix. Okay. So let me get this back on you. So guys. When you're stenciling letters, you need the tiniest bit amount on this brush. So what you're going to want to do is, I have not done a hummingbird. I'm trying to find one, but they're so small. So get you a good amount. Swirl on a clean spot of your paper. When you swirl on a clean spot, every time you go in for more, you're not going to have too much on this brush. And the black is not going to go underneath your stencil. Okay? That's what I do every time. If you do it right, you'll have perfect letters every time. Hold your stencil down as you're going and just tap it. I like my letters a little rustic, so I only go over it once, but you could totally go over your letters twice to make it more black. It's better to go over it twice than have too much on your brush the first time and it go under the stencil. So I just hold my letters down as I go and I tap it all the way through. Super simple. Always hold your letters though, because your, your brush could hit it and move it, whatever. Your paint might not stick or your tape might not stick. Hold your letters down. Just safer that way. And just tap it all the way through. When you go in for more, swirl in a clean spot. What'd you warn me about? I must have missed something. Hi, Louisa. I must have missed something. That's all right, though. So when you go in for more, always swirl in a clean spot. Ooh, nice, Connie. I didn't. Tyler, we have dinner. Don't buy anything on the way home. We have dinner. Manicotti. You'll like it. Don't buy nothing. 
Okay, see those? We're almost done. Dip it, swirl in a clean spot. This is the most important thing. Do not forget that or else you'll have a hot mess. And you don't want to have to fix the hot mess. I made it by scratch, Tyler. I made it from scratch. I cooked. I made it from scratch. <clears throat> you guys believe that? I did cook, but I didn't make it from, from scratch. Oh, yeah, your dad had liver and onions from Brad. You could share that with him. I'm sure you'd love that. He's like me. He won't eat nothing like that. I know, manicotti. I got it from Sam's. It was already cooked, and you just put it in the oven. Guys, it was amazing. Have you ever had Sam's chicken pot pie, guys? Sam's, it's already made. You pop it in the oven. Best chicken pot pie ever. So I went to get one of those. And they were out. So I got manicotti. And it was really good. And Tyler will love this manicotti. Alright, let's pull this off. Oh no, Lisa, I cannot do liver and onions. I can't even smell it. It like makes me sick to my stomach. How much time do I got? Okay, I got plenty of time to fix this. <laughs> he said I'll be the judge of that. Whatever. Let me fix my flowers since I done jacked it up. What's gross, Scott? Manicotti? Oh, two hours away? Yeah, you wouldn't be able to get it then. Thank you, Donna. Okay, so I'm going to go over my boo-boos right here because I done messed up. Put my paper on top of my wet paint. That's one thing not to do. I was just showing you what not to do. So I'm going over it, and I'm going to put me some more dots on it. No big deal. Everything's fixable when you're painting, guys. Everything. Sam's. Oh, God, Scott, you don't like that? Oh, my God, I love Sam's chicken pot pie. It's so good. It tastes homemade. Seriously, it does. All right, it's fixed. I'm going to dry it a little bit and go over it a tiny more time. It's not frozen. No, it's not frozen. Nope. Right, happy accidents. Right, John. I'm going to dry it and go over it one more time, and then we're going to put our dots back on there. It's not frozen. It's in the refrigerated section. Back by the meats and stuff, no frozen, and it's really good. All right, let's go over this one more time, and then I'll put my black dots back on it. Right, Scott. It's fresh. You just have to bake it. There ain't nothing wrong with that. Okay. So when that dries, you wouldn't be able to tell I did that. Jana made Cuban sandwiches. When Jana comes here, she cooks so good. Kurt misses her. Kurt misses Jana. All right, let me do my dots again. Let me get me a little more black. Oh, I dropped. Oh, it was my shoe. I'm like, I dropped something. It was my shoe. It was sitting on top of this little chair. Okay. Your husband would love it. <clears throat> okay, back to my dots. Just gonna add a couple more that I messed up. Stuffed salmon. Ooh, stuffed salmon. I could do that too. That sounds really good. Thanks, Janice. All right, so, guys, we're pretty much done. Let me turn it around and show it to you. It's super cute. Look how cute that is. This comes in resize too. That would be really cute on a wreath. I've made homemade chicken pot pie too, but the Sam's one is much easier and it's just as good. Oh, I can't do. They had. I looked at that today. I can't do sushi. Mm -mm. I painted a half a daisy, Gwen. I know, Scott. All right, guys, look. We're done. Isn't that adorable? There you go. And if you did a 24-inch grapevine like I do for my house, this would go on there really good. A door size. I always put door sizes on my 24-inch grapevines. All right, guys. We're all done. Isn't that adorable? I love it. Thank you, Julie. So, guys, tomorrow I'll be on at 6 because I'm in that marathon. I'm in that marathon, and Jana's on at five in that marathon, and I and they others haven't made their schedules yet for tomorrow. I don't think, but right now Scott's on with Design with Scott, so you guys go over there and check him out, 
And then after that is Crazy Crafty Mama with Amber. Um, I appreciate all you guys hanging out with me every night. And I will see you tomorrow night at 6 o'clock. Have a good night, guys. Bye.